Well, we, that was quite something. <clears throat> Bless her. Dear Andy, I know I've written you quite a few cards and letters over the last three years, but surely one more couldn't hurt. If anything, this one should be the combination of all of my thanks and gratitude, and because of that, it should be the best. If it's not, then, well, oops. Firstly, thank you, again. We are at graduation day. Where did the last three years go? I came here for the first time at 19 with not much certainty about where I wanted my life to go. And I've left at 22 with a tiny bit more of a grasp on what was ahead of me. That, along with friends and memories and more confidence than I have ever felt, those things were offered to me because of you. If I hadn't sung those songs at my audition and you hadn't given me the chance to become even more of a jabbering show-off, I wouldn't have had these threes, three years with you. One of my fondest memories of my time at Chai was just after the song list came out for prologue. You had given me a solo and I couldn't quite believe it. I remember having a heart to heart in your office and saying how I never thought in a million years I would receive an opportunity like that while I was at uni. I cried, your eyes got a bit red. <laughs> my uni years were by no means smooth, but moments like that made it worth it. When I think back to when I first met you at an open day all those years ago, you said something very distinct. Something along the lines of, all my students will learn four disciplines, to sing, to dance, to act, and most importantly, to be a nice person. It made such a huge impact on my choice and also made my, love, my mum love MTP even more. But in saying that, that's what you have inspired me to push for every day. If I couldn't for the life of me do a clean double pirouette, at least I fell out of it with a smile and I tried not to let Bronwyn or Ellie see. <laughs> Even now, if I can't get a yes at an audition, at least I ask them how their day was. That philosophy, if you will, has opened more doorways than I could have ever imagined. Thank you. I couldn't have dreamed that I would have met and worked with such a supportive, kind and fiercely loyal, hard-working person ever. You are an example to all who passed through MTP and an inspiration to all of us who have had the chance to sit and have a sob in your office. I, for one, couldn't have completed uni without you. Your generosity in all forms has given me an outlook that isn't full of dread, but one of optimism. You have helped me to find a career, a better outlook, and a smidge of happiness that I wasn't sure I would ever find. You have always said, collect moments, not things. Those three wonderful, manic, brilliant years have been full of memories, and I have a mental scrapbook to prove it. Thank you for this opportunity, for everything. You're a force to be reckoned with. Freya. <laughs> well, we, that was quite something. <clears throat> Bless her. Uh, quite emotional, actually. Um, yeah, just, you know, it's a privilege to, to work with these young people and to, to hear that you know, you have a positive impact on someone's life, I think is, uh, it makes it, makes it all worthwhile. It's what, you know, it's what we're here for. So, um, yeah, quite amazing.